Hey guys, it's uh, me, Brian, and today we're going to be reviewing Daddy Grumpy Kid Dog Days. Um, it is the fourth book of the series. Uh, this is episode number four, so I might as well just did book number four and episode number four. Uh, the cover to the book, I know where it is, but I don't have any tape. But the cover basically says, Diary of Women Get Dog Days at the bottom, it says Jeff Kenny. And um, it has basically a picture of Greg with no shirt, holding an ice cream with a towel. And his, well his ice cream is on the floor, he's on like the grass, and then he's holding his cone in his hand, just looking down, like sad, like that. Like that. Yeah. So, uh, yeah. Um, today's a big day. Uh, because, um, I should be watching Lego Ninjago right now, but I'm doing a review video. Luckily, I have it recording on my DVR. So, if you want to catch it, it's on Cartoon Network. 6.30. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure it came on at 6.30, yeah. So I should be, wa I, I could be watching it, but I just wanted to do this to get this out of the way. So I can do another book review when Ninjago, well not when Ninjago's over, I can watch it later, always. So, let's just go back into the review. Okay, well, this was back in, I got this book, like, third grade. I've read it from third grade all the way to fourth grade. It's basically him talking about summer, but just like the movie, but they cut out a lot of. S well, actually, no, they actually um kept a lot of stuff. They kept a like a lot of stuff. Well, actually, now that I'm looking at the book, they're not. They don't. They only. They only freaking put a couple stuff from the book. That's him talking about summer and everything. Dude, Jonathan. Who's up? Who the bleep is Jonathan? Okay, he's basically talking about summer. Basically, now he's scared of the showers. Th that freaking creeps me the heck out. Uh, so yeah. Orange. Yeah, I don't know. This is a used book. But the cover was there, but it was about to rip off. So basically, he talks about summer and everything. And then he like freaking. That's like I I like this book. Uh, it's not as good as the other ones, but this is one of the good. Uh, this is one of the good ones. Brian's ranking, I would say about the four stars. Four stars. I would say four stars. It it just wasn't like the first book, as I mentioned. In the episode number three, I think I like I didn't mention which was the first Red Diary. Uh, yeah, it it has to be like it should be like this book should honestly be like the freaking first one, but with summer, summer. But I I haven't read this book in a while. But then again, I just finished watching it. Not not watching it. Watching the movie. Um, a couple of days ago, but the book is better than the movie. Okay, guys. Um, uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna say uh, this is probably not gonna be in Brian's recommendation. Probably not. <laughs> I I don't know why. Actually, yeah, it just needs to be like the first one. But I'll give it. Nah, it's half of my. Approval, half of not. I'll give it. Mm. Uh, so yeah, I'll just give it that, like that. Okay, so yeah. Okay, next episode we will be reviewing the Wimpy Kid Do It Yourself book, which I just got today, like two hours ago. And then we will also be looking at flashback. Dare Eve when we could do it yourself book, the old version. So it's gonna be basically a double feature for you guys next episode next book review episode. Actually no, it's gonna be a triple review because we're gonna actually be doing another book of the Dare Eve when we could franchise. Uh yeah. 
so yeah, uh, we will also be including like the red book, the red diary, yeah, and I will show you why in the next video, so subscribe, and hit that like button, and I will see you in the next video.